Make your destiny to start manifesting. Recover your stolen glory. Possess your possession doing this. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. How are you all doing today? I believe you are doing fine. This is going to make you to recover your stolen glory. Your destiny is just going to be getting brighter and brighter. Yes, your destiny is not yet manifesting. This, by the grace of God, is going to make everything to start working well for you. In case you are new here for the first time, you are welcome. I share spiritual tips on this channel that will help your spiritual life greatly. Using natural ingredients, believing that it's going to work, having faith, you know, using your own faith, you see it working, like manifesting. So consider subscribing if you love spiritual tips. Turn on the bell so that whenever I upload videos, you get notified, okay? So I'm going to be showing you how to use only one item, only one natural ingredient, kitchen ingredients. To recover your possession like recovering your glory be it stolen glory or if your glory has not started manifesting you see your star shining brighter and brighter every time so you have to get onion you can use any color of onion you can make use of the white or this type there are about three colors of onion i think so yeah three or four colors of onion they are all very effective. Just use any type. Onion is a symbol of power. It cleanses. It cleanses out any evil spiritual attack, spiritual problems. Name it. It's a transformation of destiny. It's going to transform your destiny. Make it brighter. For example, if someone has made your destiny hidden, your destiny is not manifesting the way it should be. After making use of this, by the grace of God, believing, applying faith, you will see everything working well for you. It's also a symbol of healing. It heals. When you use it, the way I'm going to show you, if you have any spiritual attack, like spiritual sickness, you will see that you'll be getting better and better by the grace of God. So this is what you have to do. Get onion, any size, any type, any color. You will not remove the peel. This is the peel. Do not remove the peel. Just cut it into how many times you want to cut. Cut it, cut it, cut everything. With the peel, okay? Then you have to soak it into water. Soak it for about 12 hours. After soaking it, you have to strain out that water. Get a bucket or a bowl. Mix your bath water. Then you add that onion water into it. So after adding that soaked onion water, they have to be praying, declare into that water. Start declaring, say your mind, pour out your mind, any kind of affliction you have been passing through. Be saying it, be praying. But before praying, you have to read Isaiah 54 verse 17. This is a very strong prayer. Isaiah 54 verse 17. Start declaring into that water. No weapon form against you shall prosper. Every tongue that rises up against you in judgment shall be condemned. As you are reading it, then you start praying, declaring, declaring. Pour out your mind. After doing so, then you have to have your bath every day for seven days. If you really need a turnaround in your life, if you really need things to start changing, like changing for good. So I know people will start asking, seven days is too much. Can they do it one day? three days this is especially for you to do it seven days if you want your destiny to start shining to start manifesting you know the way god has created you to be you have to do this i know there is a saying that all fingers are not equal which is true but god created everyone to be great okay and if you notice that your destiny is not manifesting and you are getting 40 years, 50 years, 70 years, then you know that something is wrong. It's not late anyway. You have to do this. You can do any type of prayer, any type of work. But I'm telling you that this particular one is highly very effective. If you can do this, you will see that things will be turning well for you. By the grace of God, it's going to work for you just the way it's working for others. So another way to do this, if you don't want to soak it, you can blend it. You can blend it with the shell, with the peel. But you have to cut it like that. 
blend it with the with the skin. Do not remove the skin. The skin is also part of the work. Blend it very well. Use water to blend. After blending it, strain it to squeeze out the juice. Of course, when you want to blend it, you have to add water. So you have to add the juice. It is your bath water. Use it to have your bath. I know people will be saying that it will make them to smell, it will do that. But this is a spiritual work and you have to do this. Do not make use of soap or sponge. You can decide to have your bath first before making use of this. Use any soap of your choice. Use any sponge of your choice. After having your bath, then you have to use the water to have your bath finally after praying. Repeat this for seven days every morning, every morning. The first morning, the upper morning, just seven days. After using it in the morning, in the evening, you can decide to have your normal bath, okay? Go ahead and try this tip and you see how effective it's going to be. God is going to intervene for you. God is going to pass through it and bless you. Your star will start shining. Your destiny, your stolen glory will be recovered by the grace of God. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, share it to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I will see you in my next video.